class. Cool. Class. I just learned how to do that. Yes. Today, we have a new student from the Earth Science Department. Say hi to Lonnie Turpin. Hi, Lonnie. Hello. What's happening? Hey, Lonnie, you're cool. Do you want to do a thousand page puzzle with me sometime? No, I'm just anxious to learn and try new things. Who is it this time? Let's just say some students and their professor are bad eggs and they need to be removed from this fine institution. Uh, what do you mean like try new things, like glamping? Uh, yeah, something like that. I'm Professor Rich, expert in science. These are my devoted students. Together with the aid of harmless drugs, we explore science's greatest hypothetical questions. Cats. <gasps> oh. Also known as Felis catus. Average lifespan, 15 years. One of the top 200 animals. I like dogs. No, dogs suck. Yeah, cats. No, I'm afraid it's dogs. No, no. no. yes, dogs stop suck. it. Dogs suck. Dogs suck. Dogs suck. Dogs suck. Dogs suck. We need something to take the edge off. You mean like a smoothie? Mm. Okay, cool your jets. What if cats became extinct? Oh. I would be very sad because I love cats. Yeah. You know what? Cats if you say something like you that again, I'm going to go Please, let's not have a relapse, okay? Relapse. I'd like to run around in circles for a minute. Okay, but don't make any noise. Psst. Jack, what illegal drug do you think he's on? Oh, oh no, no, he's just a super big weirdo. I can hear you guys. I decided to meet an expert on dinosaurs. Who would know better about extinction than a dinosaur? Expert. I'm going to be taking my glasses on and off throughout the interview. I just thought I would warn you of that. I appreciate yeah, the heads okay. up. Now, your specialty, do you deal with extinction? We deal a lot with extinction in paleontology. Now, what is an animal that might be in danger of being extinct right now? Um, the Iberian lynx is a good one in the cat family. Possum? Possum, not so much. OK, I just thought maybe possum. What if uh, cats became extinct, all of them? It yes. would be uh, a very interesting phenomenon. It would result in a, a loss of a very charismatic group of mammals. How would a cat become extinct? What would be the scenario for this sort of thing happening? So a lot of this is kind of speculation in terms of what would cause a, a species extinction. A lot but of what I deal is speculation. That doesn't surprise me yes. either. Uh, but a lot of the, the time when we're dealing with domesticated organisms, whether they be crops or animals, uh, you can see reduced levels of genetic diversity, and that sometimes makes them more susceptible to disease. I see. You're a dog person. This interview's done. I smoke a marijuana cigarette with one Leonard Kravitz. <gasps> Whoa! Cool! I don't say this very often, but... You rock. <laughs> Ugh, anyway, let's conduct an experiment, OK? Now, this is an ecosystem with cats as an integral part, OK? This is when we take out the cats. See how it's changed? Whoa, cheese consumption is almost down to nothing. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is going to happen to cheeseburgers? Oh, speaking of uh, cheeseburgers, I've got a wicked case of the munchies. Yeah, I'm feeling a bit peckish yeah, myself. Too. Does anyone have any food? No. I guess we'll just have to light up. Who's holding? Oh, I've got a huge stash right here. Let me find As it. As an agent of Eastern Montana State here University. Here we go. Mm. Oh, boy. Nice. I love these. <laughs> mm. They're balls of cheese. Mm. They're Perfect. so yummy. Tulani. What were you saying about being an agent? Uh, nothing. I'm, I'm Asian, 100% Japanese, actually, so... I needed to go straight to the source. That's right, a cat lady. What if 
Okay, this is a cat. Yes, right. that is a cat. What if the possibility that cats became extinct? Would you be doing something else? Yes. What other animals would you be? I think I would be helping horses. Possum? I would help an opossum. I've helped many of them. Uh, for society in general, how we would react, I would say it might be a cat astrophe. Well, cats have been domesticated since the Egyptians. So right. about 4,000 years. So cats definitely serve a purpose in our society. They do. They actually do serve a purpose. They lower our blood pressure, and there are studies that have shown children who grow up with... Oh, I'm a mommy. <laughs> You're a good mommy. Oh. Just don't let go. And the irony is, I'm allergic to cats. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but do you take anything for it? Uppers, downers, middlers, meth? Well, uh, an antihistamine. Who else takes some? But state your name first, clearly and loudly. Jenny Pearson. Uh, J-E-N. Ha-ha! All right, Mary Do Wells, the jig is up. I'm finally shutting down this low-class class. But why? Drug use, and I got it all on tape. Whoa, new guy's a narc. Lonnie's a narcoleptic? You can't fire me. I've got tenure. Tenure 12 miles away. <laughs> what? What the what is fuck? What does that mean? You crowbar that joke. I don't totally. get it. It's not even a joke. Right joke. If you want to construct a joke. Shut up! Consider this class terminated. <gasps> terminated. 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 <gasps> terminated. 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 Sometimes I think I'm a cat. Rare. Boy, it's sure good to not be teaching anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's too bad you're just a big stupid loser now. Yeah, you're a scum. I kind of wish you were dead right now. Yeah, you right. suck, stupid so idiot. All right, okay, loser. Enough. enough. He's left. <laughs>